Hi children, in this video we are going to learn new topic, an interesting topic, placenta. What is placenta? Placenta is an organ that performs during pregnancy. It grows in the uterian wall. Uterian wall grow agakudiya or a temporary organ the placenta. It plays a vital role in fetal growth and development. And the karu valaradhuku and the karu order development ko is a mukia pangavagikid. Why is placenta important? The placenta is unborn baby's life support system. Or kuranda thayoda karu varilar kumurda support system a irkar the placenta. That is development of the placenta. In the placenta, we connect with the mother and fetus. We connect with the mother That is called it as umbilical cord. Placenta connects the mother to the fetus. This is placenta. Placenta connects the mother to the fetus through the umbilical cord. This is called it as Umbilical cord. In Tamil, we used to say topul kodi. Abdi solu. Umbilical cord. Most of the students confuse between the placenta and umbilical cord. Right? Narayapir ke pama students. Must what is the difference between placenta and umbilical cord? What is placenta? Placenta is a temporary organ. Right? It is present only in the pregnant woman. It plays a vital role. It gives Development growth to the young one, right? Placenta in the fetus order connect panna kudiye rope like structure the umbil umbilical cord topul kodi abdin solu. Don't be confused with placenta and umbilical cord. Got it? Yes. Placenta is actually a temporary endocrine gland. Why means it secretes hormones during pregnancy. That's what it coined as temporary endocrine organ. It formed during pregnancy. Non-pregnant woman, it is absent. It connects the fetus, karuva, uterian wall order, uterus order, wall order, connect pannuma. Yedu moolama connect pannu abdin padina, umbilical cord order connect pannu. See to the picture, listen carefully. It's actually a yeah, fetus, right? This is placenta. Then this is umbilical cord. Fetus. Right? Growing fetus. Umbilical cord. Placenta. Got it? Purunjida. In the placenta, we have a section. What is the placenta? This is the uterine tissue. Order. Placenta portion. This is fetus. Order. Placenta portion. Fetus order placenta portion rukum, mother order placenta portion rukum, maternal placenta portion. Right? See the picture. This is this part is called it as maternal placental portion. Then this portion is called it as umbilical portion. That is the fetus order placental portion. Got it? Functions of placenta. It provides nutrition. It acts as a respiratory medium. It performs excretion. Main function, it provides nutrition to the fetus. It acts as a respiratory medium. It plays a vital role in the excretion. Point number five. Hembryo's heart develops during fourth week of pregnancy. One karula heart yappa develop ago? Fourth week of pregnancy. And circulates blood through the umbilical cord, placenta, umbilical cord, yes, got it, as well as its own tissue. Tannoda tissue ko seta the blood circulation na pass pan. Shall I repeat it again? Embryos are developed during the fourth week of pregnancy. Then, it circulates the blood through the umbilical cord. Umbilical cord varia, blood pass pannu, then placenta, then its own tissue. Got it? 
During pregnancy, the placenta acts as an endocrine gland because it produces following hormones. It produces large quantities of human chorionic gonadotrophin, HCG. Human chorionic somatomammotrophin, HCS or otherwise it is known as human placental lactogen HPL estrogen progesterone idala enada pregnancy time la secret aga kudiya hormone oru oru female conceive a irundanga na avangaloda body la secret aga kudiya pregnancy hormone yaar la pathina human chorionic gonadotrophin short form hcg human chorionic somatomammotrophin HCS or human placental lactogen HPL estrogen and progesterone these hormones essential for normal pregnancy these hormones secreted by placenta that's what placenta acts as a temporary endocrine gland because this placenta secretes pregnancy hormone hormone is secret pandradunala id endocrine gland கன்சிடர் பண்றாங்க அதுவும் எப்ப மட்டும் இந்த பிரெக்னன்சி ஹார்மோனை செக்ரேட் பண்ணும் பிரெக்னன்ட் டைம்ல மட்டும் இது ஃபார்ம் ஆகி செக்ரேட் பண்றதுனால இத டெம்பரரி எண்டோக்ரைன் கிளான் சொல்றாங்க நான் பிரெக்னன்ட் உமன்ல பிளசன்டா கிடையாது got it புரிஞ்சதா so exam timeல नीटல கூட இந்த ফুল ஃபார்ம் கேக்கும்போது நீங்க ফুল ஃபார்ம் எல்லா இதுக்கும் ஒரு தனியா ஒரு நோட் போட்டு எழுதி வைக்கிறது நல்லது hcg hcs hpl these are the important pregnancy hormone functions of placenta shall we recap it once again respiratory function nutritive function excretory function it produces enzyme and then it produces uh, pregnancy associated plasma protein pap p a p p production of pregnancy associated plasma protein barrier function barrier function means it acts as act as a barrier okay it acts as a barrier between the fetus and mother endocrine function now only we completed endocrine function right it secretes a pregnancy hormone that's what it is considered to be a endocrine gland partial endocrine organ yes some of the question students used to ask after completing the placenta topic what are the quick review paaklama enna questions la namak placenta and topic la எடுக்கும்போது வரும் அப்படின்னு பாத்தீங்கன்னா உனக்கு தோணக்கூடிய கொஸ்டின் ஒரு பதினெட்டுலருந்து வளர்ந்துட்டேங்க <laughs> it grow throughout the pregnancy at the time of delivery around 1 pound the way around 1 pound is the placenta is part of the baby or the mother most of the question uh, most of the students ask me like that miss placenta and rather mother kid and form agda illa baby kid and form agda mother body la otti irukuma illa baby form pandradala otti irukuma indha mari different questions la ellarku raise agum right parunga is the placenta is part of the baby or mother the placenta is a feto maternal organ important neat question feto maternal organ ye yeah, poi feto maternal organ appdi solrena it consists of two parts fetal placenta okay see the picture it's a fetal placenta fetus pakkathla irukirathu baby nu nechukonga adu pakkathla irukirathu fetal placenta they that fetal placenta develops from the same blastocyst blastocyst oda 
outer most coverage pathum that is trophoblast trophoblast la irundhu implant appa adu enna va form pannu placenta va form pandrathu chorionic villi ellam finger like projection la last video la paathom laya so that is called as fetal placenta right and the maternal placenta this area is called as maternal placenta maternal placenta that develops from the tissue of the maternal uterus imagine this is a uterus uterine cavity ulla irukku id uterus wall so blastocyst kitta irundhu form avakoodiyathu fetal placenta uterine tissue la form avakoodiyathu enadhu maternal uterus placental portion adha decidua basilis appdin solluvanga important neat question maternal la irundhu form avakoodiya placenta uterus la endha layer la form avum appdin pathina maternal uterus la decidua basalis adula irundhu form avum eppadi blastocyst la irundhu blastocyst la trophoblast la irundhu enna placenta form aachi fetus placenta form aachi right will you able to understand this is blastocyst blastocyst la trophoblast irundhathu adu uterus la uterus wall la implant aaga poludhu appa indha edathila placenta yerpaduthum right adhe maadhiri uterus la maternal portion la decidua basalis abindra oru tissue layer irukum adula irundhu maternal placenta form aagum so adanal placenta va enna solrom feto maternal organ fetus liyo contribute irukum mother maternal tissue va contribution irukum adanal placenta is the feto maternal organ yes next question nare students kepanga miss placenta endha edathula irukum placenta and the uterus la front la irukuma back la irukuma idha uterus la nenichukonga uterus la enga miss irukum right side irukuma left side irukuma illa top la form aaguma placenta implantation position ah poruthu placental formation implantation for example inga paarenga indha picture la irukirathu i will zoom and show you see this is a posterior placenta see it's a posterior placenta this is anterior placenta posterior placenta anterior placenta posterior anterior placenta na enna the placenta is attached to the back of the uterus uterus oda back la and the placenta formation irundaduna that is called it as posterior placenta innona anterior placenta the placenta is attached in front of the uterine wall uterine wall oda front la form panna ipo red color la annotate pandra paarenga that is front of the uterine wall below the mother's belly mother belly ku below a form ana that is anterior placenta so posterior placenta anterior placenta both are normal one more placenta formation will be there see the picture this is fundus placenta uterus oda top region fundus we know that one so and the edathla placenta form aachna fundus placenta so that position is also a yeah, common but what is the main consequence means difference between the normal placenta and abnormal placenta due to implantation normal placenta la indha edathla form a irukum parunga right that is normal placenta but placenta previa abindra or condition irukku correct and the cervix a lock pandra mari form aagum placenta previa complete placenta previa na full ah inga lock pannidum partial na indha edathla paadi lock pannu indha maadhiri placenta previa irukum pachathla they have to consult the medical practitioner got it this is the placental position this is also a extra point for you next what about the twins miss next question you will ask what about the twins miss twins la pathina rendu placenta thani thaniya form alla rendu baby ku thani thaniya placenta nutrition ah adoda function ah seiyalam appadi illa monochorionic condition abindra podula rendu babies um ore placenta va share pannikka mudiyum thani thani placenta um irukalam shared placenta um irukalam idu eppa twins condition la right how is the placenta delivered miss placenta ஒரு குழந்தை எக்ஸ்பல் ஆனதுக்கு அப்புறம் வயிற்றுக்குள்ளே இருக்குமா பிரெக்னன்சிக்கு அப்புறமா டெலிவரி பாச்சுரேஷன் சொல்லுவோம் ஆஃப்டர் த டெலிவரி வாட் வில் ஹேப்பன் சி 
See the picture. Baby. This is real placenta. This is umbilical cord. Right. Usually there are mild contraction. Sometimes that may not happen. That could help placenta to separate from the uterine wall and move through the birth canal. Okay. The birth canal. Delivery agapodu. So young one. Baby oda. Head push agi veliya varum bodu. In the uterine cavity la. Implant ayirka kudiya. Stick ayirka kudiya. Placenta wom will come out. Expels outside. Right. So in the vaginal delivery. If it is a normal delivery. That st third stage of labor begins with childbirth. Ends with the placental delivery. Child birth up a placenta um veliya deliver agum. Medical practitioner may inject oxytocin into pregnant woman body to induce uterine contraction. Up an alla contract panada and now it expels the placenta along with the delivered baby. So, yenna injection kodwanga oxytocin. Idoda is the name pitocin. And the injection oda brand name pitocin, it has oxytocin. In C section, C section we know that the cesarean. Cesarean is in the abdominal region. La, insist pani baby the cesarean solu. Operation pani koran the edukar solu. So, a medical practitioner physically removes the placenta. So, in the expel agi varadhi, they used to cut and remove the placenta. Before closing the incision, the remaining fragments of removed placenta is cleaned well. Infection aga markar the gaga. So, placenta delivery a copper minor ko. It expels outside. Yes. Purjida. Next video. We are going to learn about embryonic origin of tissue. Thank you children.